Okay, today we're going to be doing reflections. Uh, when the mirror line is attached to the object. So over here we have a triangle uh, placed right there. And then we also need a mirror line, which is this object right here. And essentially the mirror line is, and what reflections are, is what happens if you were just looking in the mirror? You would get the opposite side. So, where the mirror line is also very key, because you, in this case, the mirror line, or the line of reflection, is vertical. Uh, this is going to give you a horizontal mirror image. So over here on this triangle that we have over here, we want to make sure that the triangle is looking into the mirror this way, and on the other side of the mirror, how would it look back? Okay? So, in this case, when it's attached to the object, we could see that the mirror line attaches right over there. We, that's where we can use our starting point. So when we're drawing our triangle, we want to start in the exact same point, because everything has to be equal here. Okay? Now, this is almost going to be like connecting the dots. The next point that we need to have is the top of the triangle, which is over here and we need to figure out the distance away from the mirror line and this triangle, the top of the triangle, is one square away from the mirror so when we're drawing the other side of the mirror we also have to know that the top of the triangle is going to be one square away from the mirror line on the opposite side now for the third part we need the third part of the triangle. And again, you're going to count the distance away from the mirror line that this is. And we could count one, two squares away from the mirror line. So the bottom left corner of this triangle is going to be the bottom right corner of the mirrored triangle. And that also has to be two squares away. And now that we have this, we could now connect our dots to make our triangle. So we connect there and there and then we finish up our triangle going across and now we have a reflected image of a triangle. The triangle has to stay the exact same size, it has to be congruent and it has to be opposite of the other side. So this is a vertical mirror line reflection with the mirror line attached to the object.